10 Subconscious Behaviors That Make People Ignore You Are you often overlooked or not taken seriously in social situations? If you find yourself nodding in agreement or shaking your head in frustration, know that you're not alone in experiencing these sentiments. It can be disheartening to contribute to a conversation only to be met with blank stares or dismissed entirely. However, it's possible that certain subconscious habits may be contributing to these reactions from others. In this video, we identify 10 such behaviors and provide practical tips to ensure that your voice is heard clearly. Let's dive right in. 1. Negative Body Language Nonverbal communication holds significant weight, often surpassing the impact of our spoken words. One common cause of being ignored stems from unintentionally conveying negative body language. When you display closed-off gestures such as crossed arms, avoiding eye contact, or adopting a tense or slouched posture, it sends a signal that you are unapproachable or disengaged. This may lead others to dismiss you or overlook your presence, assuming you're not interested in participating or contributing to the conversation. Consequently, it's crucial to be mindful of your body language, aiming to project open and welcoming signals to enhance communication and foster better interpersonal connections. 2. Weak or Timid Voice The manner in which you employ your voice, whether it's the tone, volume, or clarity, hold significant sway over how much attention others devote to your words. A voice that is too soft, hesitant, or challenging to comprehend may convey a lack of confidence or authority, leading others to disregard your message. Enhance your vocal delivery by practicing a fuller, steadier tone and enunciating words more clearly, even if it feels somewhat unnatural initially. A slight increase in volume can also be beneficial, but be cautious not to veer into yelling territory. Strive for a well-modulated voice that commands attention without becoming overpowering. By cultivating a more robust and authoritative vocal presence, you can exude greater confidence and conviction in your communication, thereby increasing the likelihood of being heard and taken seriously by others. 3. Frequently using filler words. Excessive reliance on filler words like, like, um, and, you know, can create the impression that you lack confidence or haven't thoroughly considered your words. As a result, others might assume that you don't possess valuable insights and may start dismissing your statements. Although entirely eliminating filler words may not be feasible, it's advisable to work on reducing their frequency. Aim to speak with greater intention and thoughtfulness, ensuring the careful selection of your words. By minimizing the use of filler words, you improve the clarity and effectiveness of your communication, thereby enhancing the chances of being actively listened to and taken seriously. 4. Constantly interrupting. When you consistently prioritize your own voice over listening to others, it can lead to people ignoring you. Constantly interjecting and cutting off someone while they speak sends a message that you don't value their thoughts or opinions. It's crucial to provide people with the space to express themselves and demonstrate genuine interest in what they have to say. Pose meaningful follow-up questions and convey that you value and appreciate their thoughts and feelings. By refining your listening skills, you can cultivate stronger connections and reduce the chances of being overlooked. 5. Not contributing anything to the conversation. People might be overlooking you because you might not be an engaging conversationalist. If your conversations mostly center around small talk or if you seldom share personal details about yourself, it can dissuade others from wanting to sustain a connection with you. To shift this dynamic and enhance your likelihood of capturing people's attention, assess your conversation skills. Reflect on whether you are genuinely providing something meaningful in return. This way, you can make necessary adjustments and enhance your capacity to connect with others on a more profound level. 6. Excessive Bragging Feeling pride in your achievements and wanting to share them is natural. However, Consistently bragging about yourself can create a gap between you and others. Instead of solely centering on your accomplishments, actively involve yourself in the lives of those around you. Inquire about their experiences and genuinely express curiosity. This approach fosters an environment of openness and receptivity, promoting deeper engagement and more meaningful conversations. 7. Always complaining. 
Although it's natural to seek an outlet for venting occasionally, turning complaining into a habit can be off-putting to others. Negativity tends to spread and creates an unpleasant atmosphere for everyone. To avoid this, redirect your focus toward the positive aspects. Cultivating optimism and radiating positive energy can be captivating, drawing others toward you. Embracing positivity ensures that others are less inclined to overlook you. 8. Apologizing too much. Apologizing excessively, particularly for trivial reasons, conveys a message of low confidence and suggests that your words may not be worth paying attention to. When apologies are offered excessively, even before speaking, it establishes a perception of vulnerability. Expressions like, sorry to bother you, or, I'm sorry if this sounds stupid, might lead others to tune out from the outset. To enhance the probability of being heard, concentrate on conveying your thoughts and ideas with confidence and conviction. Save apologies for situations where you genuinely make a mistake. 9. Being overly critical. It's admirable that you genuinely care about the well-being of others and wish the best for them. However, this mindset can sometimes result in excessive criticism, especially if you focus solely on pointing out their mistakes. Consistently criticizing others may lead people to view you as someone who only sees faults, potentially causing them to disregard your input, even if your intentions are positive. I'm not suggesting that you should refrain from offering feedback or allowing people to learn from their mistakes. Constructive criticism is crucial for personal growth. Yet, incorporating words of encouragement and giving compliments can help mitigate the impact of your critique. Striking a balance between criticism and support can foster healthier and more receptive communication. 10. Getting distracted easily. If you invest more time scrolling through social media or responding to messages than actively engaging in a conversation, it indicates that you're not fully present. Such behavior can make the other person feel undervalued, as if their presence or words don't matter. Being easily distracted can also impede effective communication, resulting in misunderstandings and misinterpretations, further prompting people to ignore or disregard you. To enhance your engagement and demonstrate the importance you place on the conversation, offer the other person your complete attention. This fosters a more meaningful exchange for everyone involved. In summary, it is crucial to recognize subconscious behaviors that might unintentionally distance people in social settings. By acknowledging these habits, you can consciously strive to become more engaging and attentive, fostering stronger connections and creating a positive impact in your interactions with others. If you enjoyed watching this video don't forget to like subscribe and turn on the notification bell, so you don't miss any new videos. Let us know your thoughts about this video in the comments section down below and feel free to stay and enjoy it until the end, also make sure to check out our next highlighted video and we will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe.